if you click to watch this video it simply means you're probably wondering what an african woman wants is it about what she told you she wants or your speculations or your assumption there are lots and lots of assumptions out there about what african women truly want a lot of people do confuse what attracts a woman from what a woman truly wants and in today's video we should talk about what an african woman wants if this is your first time of watching my videos go ahead and smash the like button subscribe turn on the notification bell so that you get notified when i post new content and if you're a returning subscriber you've been watching my videos thank you so much i'm so grateful i appreciate you the want of an african woman depends on her social status or the kind of class she belongs to however a typical african woman we want this six major things. If you really want to find out about what they want, why don't you grab your popcorn, sit down, and watch till the end of this video? You may be surprised. Number one, a typical African woman wants a man who is well to do. Okay, let me say it properly. They want a rich man. No matter how wealthy an African woman is, she wants to get wealthier. The more the money, the more the purchase. So depending on the kind of a man she is yearning for, she needs money. I'm not saying that she will not end up getting married to somebody who is a normal guy or somebody who is wealthy or not wealthy, or sometimes they may even end up marrying someone who is not as rich as they are. However, that has to do with the laws of attraction. In my next video, I will be explaining to you what you would do to make a woman, an African woman, fall in love with you. What you will do to make an African woman desire you. That is different from what she truly wants. And that is what many people do confuse with. A woman may want something, she may end up not getting it. However, what exactly does she want? She wants money. So the earlier you know that, the better for you. So if you do not have enough money or you are not wealthy, maybe there are other characteristics that you possess that will be able to lure her to you. Number two, an African woman wants a man or a lover with an intellectual awareness. Let me put it this way. She wants someone who understands whatever it is the two of them are getting into. And that is why real women will first ask you, what exactly are we doing? You see them after going out with you, maybe after one or two months, they want to find out exactly what they're doing with you. There must be a definition because if you do not really understand what you are getting into, then how are you going to be committed to the relationship? Is this a serious relationship or are we just having fun? An African woman does not need a time waster. So, do not waste her time. Number three, an African woman wants a winner in the home. It depends on what you are winning. Maybe an emotional support, breadwinner. If her status is higher, maybe she is wealthy. She may want you to give her the emotional support. So, are you ready to deliver it? She wants that from you. An African woman wants you to back her up, to support her emotionally, to support her spiritually, and to support her psychologically. You know, women are easily depressed. Some can get depressed for just a little or no reason. So she needs you to be there for her. Number four, an African woman wants a man who challenges them to be a better version of themselves. You know why you're challenging them to be better? Because you as a man, you have bearing. You are focused and you know what he wants. They know that this is where I am. I want to be a better person tomorrow. And for me to be better, my wife will also need to be better. So you see, both of you will move in tandem. You help her out in her career by pushing her, making her a better person. If she's into business, then she will need to excel in her business. 
If she's a teacher or a nurse, she will need to be promoted. She will need to move higher in her career. And this will also match with your own vision. Just like I said, because you have theory. There are men who are busy talking down on their women. You may rent an apartment for her or open a business for her, but you will end up using your mouth to slander her. It will affect her negatively. Number five, an African woman wants a man of faith. How strong are you? You need to place your faith in your woman, believe in your woman. She wants you to believe in her, to believe in what she's able to do and achieve. If she has decided to take up a career, you should believe that she will achieve her dreams. And that comes with some inspirational talks, guidance, mentorship, being there with a strong faith that she's going to achieve her aim. Another part of having faith is you believing in your wife. Some men do believe the words of strangers or outsiders than the words of their woman. A typical African woman wants you to believe her. When she says yes, her yes should be her yes. Meaning that you should support her and believe her when she narrates a story to you. I'm not saying that there are no bad men out there. There are terrible women out there. However, if you began to question the integrity of your woman to the point that you rather believe what outsiders said about her than what she told you, then I would say you should dissolve that relationship. Number six, an African woman wants a man who is loyal in words and character. I'm talking about cheating. A typical African woman wants a man who will not cheat on her. She wants a man who is faithful. That does not mean that she may not end up marrying someone who is not faithful. However, what she truly wants is to get a man who is faithful to her. You see, what an African woman truly wants, she may end up not getting. She may get some, she may not get some. But in the end, these are what she truly wants. 